All right, so part one went pretty well, and then I went to record uh -oh. the second part. Uh oh. And suddenly things stopped going so well. So we're back once again with Bernie McBurnface, who, along with being a burn ward patient, also has these negative traits. With all those negative traits, you'd have to wonder how Mr. McBurnface even made it to the start of the apocalypse. But the good news for Bernie is he gets lots of positive traits too, some of which will definitely help him out later down the line. You know, if he lives that long. So once again, I spawn with absolutely nothing, skin cooked very well done, and with night sprinters enabled. Let's see how far Bernie makes it. Oh, I love walking rolls. All right. Sir or ma'am, I do not have the time for this. I would like your jacket though. And your watch, thank you. I guess I'll wear your socks too. Oh, shoes. That's also probably a good thing to wear. T-shirt. I just realized I'm not wearing any underwear. That's a little indecent. Also probably highly uncomfortable in these jeans. Wherever the hell these are. What the fuck? Oh! I thought the zombie just, like, teleported for a second, honestly. Ah! There's a very sturdy door, though. Alright, now, just like the last time, I need to find a cooking pot. Because I would really like to clean all these rags and antique boots. What the? Wait, I could run faster in these? Pretty good find, goddamn. Oh, okay, uh. I'll let this first guy in. That was his mistake. I definitely have to find. Okay, just gonna stay away from over there. A cooking pot. What? What? How did you guys see me? Alright, whatever. That was your guys' mistake. Okay, maybe it was my mistake. Okay. okay, a little out of hand here. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well, guess we're not going to be staying in that house. Okay, now it could be a huge mistake going back out the store. Okay, here we go again. Okay, I guess I'm not staying in this house either. Okay, well, those are saucepans. Hey, okay. You'll love to see it. Alright. Wow, this is such an informative TV show. Just open your eyes, you know? A sausage pasta. 
Somehow I don't think that's right. <laughs> I also don't think that's right. <laughs> hey, you guys. Yo, this house has a fireplace in it. Ooh, okay. Just gonna go ahead and quickly open this window before the Ah, they already broke it. Uh-oh. Ah, how'd you get me? No, oh, God. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Zombies pouring in. If I oh, fuck, if I can just stomp on one of them. Oh. Hey, there's a lake here. God, these fucking bandages. Oh, gee, I wonder where I leveled up. Oh, shocking. Now, if only that skill actually had a purpose. Empty bottle. Is that... Ah, oh, it's the whiskey bottle you want. I think the whiskey or the bourbon bottle has the uh, best container capacity for carrying liquids Rel relative to its weight and size and all that fun, uh, fun stuff. Okay, here we go again. Uh-oh. Okay, if I'm quick, I can take these guys out. That zombie was nowhere near me. Oh, holy shit. Alright. Fucking trees and their hitboxes are so annoying. The fuck is. That looks like a laser gun. Oh, of course the door's not locked this time. Fucking bullshit. Oh, I should go smoke cigarettes. What am I doing? That's why I came here. Oh, finally. I hear zombies somewhere. Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, Jesus Christ, I got stuck on the environment for a second. Okay. Got a few cars over here. There's so many zombies right there. Let's desanitize. Disinfect some rags. Oh, oh my god. Oh, holy shit. <laughs> uh, man, it's a good thing she was not doing anything. 